Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to Cold Waters, the Cold War naval action game from the folks over at Killerfish Games. Today, we're going to try to land some Navy SEALs inside of a Soviet harbor as we have a gauntlet of enemy forces looking for us somewhere along this whole uh, waterway here. We need to get to this blue circle, and in front of us lies a lot of enemy ships. So if you guys want to see more of this already, go ahead and hit that like button. Let us know you want to see more. There's definitely some Soviet ships around here we got to be cautious about. So let's go ahead and, uh, we're already rigged for ultra quiet. We're going to try to avoid enemy ships as soon as possible. So let's go ahead and start dropping down here. And again, if you guys are new here, go ahead and subscribe as well. This is a fantastic game. And it's going to be very exciting as we play our game yet again. Well, they're going to be hunting for us. We're going to be trying to hide and evading all of their tactics to find us, which include uh, sonar and so much more. There's an enemy ship up here, and they're looking for us already. So let's go ahead and start trying to detect what this enemy ship is. We're going to bring up our, uh, there we go, we're going to bring up our uh, little uh, sonar here, our little uh, reference chart and sonar, and or rather our signature uh, book here. Let's find out what they've got. I'm sure this is like a Kirvak or something big, some sort of a destroyer, I would assume. Cresta, oh, that's something I would have imagined it being. Uh, oh, a cannon, DDG. All right, that's what we're going to mark that is. So sonar has designated that Sierra 1 as a cannon. So the Sierra 1 is uh, designated now, and we need to uh, stay behind these ships, try to stay in their baffle as we uh, play with one of the best submarines that the U.S. has to offer here in service since, uh, I think, 67. The Sturgeon class is not something you want to mess with. We're limited on our torpedoes. We've only got four of them here today, and the reason that is is because we're hauling Navy SEALs. They're on a mission to go behind enemy lines, sabotage, assassinate, whatever Navy SEALs do best. Our mission is to drop them off. So let's go ahead and get ready to... Uh, I guess level off here. Mm, maybe about 500 feet should be good. Or 600 feet. We're at 500 feet now. Let's keep going in here. All right, cannon. We're going to try to get behind that ship so we can try to stay in the baffles. Let's go ahead and level off right about now. We'll try to level off at about 600 feet. We're compressing time now. Looks like we're about at uh, 650, so right in between. There goes that enemy ship. Uh oh. Hold on. They might be looking for us. Let's go ahead and try to wreck that enemy ship already. There's no time to be stealthy. we got to get in there and launch those seals. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and put them on auto-detect. Hit the sky. All right, there he goes. All right, let's hit all these enemy ships. Now, our secondary objective is to be stealthy, but I think it'd be a little bit more fun to actually hit these enemy ships, and I know you guys want to see some exciting action here in cold water, so let's go ahead and uh, turn away from our... Torpedo launching position. Let's try to get a little deeper. We're still going to run a little slower here and uh, see if we can avoid all their detection. They could have helicopters. They could have aircraft. There goes our torpedo. She's found her target. Oh, boy. This ain't good. Not good for that enemy ship. All right. Here she is. Enemy ship is uh, on the run. It looks like our, uh, our uh, torpedo has found it. The cannon is running. Look at that, man. Fully loaded with missile launchers, guns, times three. Not a good sight. Plus torpedoes. Could actually fire torpedoes off the side. But speaking of torpedoes, she's on the run from one right now. Oh boy, here she comes. Right in the water. Say hello to the Mark 48, you Soviet son bitch. Oh yeah, get some, baby. Now, of course, I'm supposed to be stealthy, but what what fun is that if we're not blowing up stuff? This is America, damn it. All right, here we go. Yeah, enemy ship destroyed. The cannon is out. That's it, baby. She's sinking to the bottom. Very nice. Now, of course, we're supposed to be stealthy and everything like that, but this is just for a little bit of action. Plus, we only got only, only four torpedoes with us, so let's go ahead and speed up time now. We can't reload this. There's no reloads available. Let's go ahead and put her back into alter quiet and continue on course. Now, obviously, a better player, um, somebody, for example, like uh, Jive Turkey, would know exactly what to do, what angle to come from, how deep to stay. I'm not that kind of a player. I'm more of a newbie. But that's what makes this game fun and fantastic. I'm sure everybody will be saying, why did you do this? Why did you do that? Who cares? It is a game, and we're having a ton of fun with it, and that's what it's all about. Look at that ship coming to the rest at the bottom now. You can see all the bubbles coming out, all that oxygen escaping. Rip to that crew, but we're on our mission. We're on to our next position now. There's other ships out here to destroy. We gotta. I've never actually done this successfully before, so our objective is to try to launch those Navy SEALs within that uh, area there, and I think we might be able to launch them uh, once we're in position, what? Three out of four. Oh, that's our, uh, that's our uh, remaining. Uh, ooh, I thought I heard something big coming down on us. That's our remaining torpedoes. 
All right, there's a Sierra 3 and Sierra 2 are now coming towards us because of the uh, explosion. They probably got radioed to that there was some sort of trouble. Let's go ahead and find out what we're looking at next. Our next signature is going to be a, hmm, let's see, Kirvac, no. Oh, possibly that one right there. Could possibly be the Pody FF, possibly. Uh, I'm not seeing a signature over here for that. Well, there is a line at the end. I don't know. Could be a freighter of some sort. Let's see here. We're going to have to try to find what this is. We'll open up the book here once we've identified the signature. And that's what's a little bit uh, more entertaining about this game is it's a matching mission to know what you're... This could be an aircraft carrier above us. Could be King Kong himself. Who knows? Well, we got to get a little bit closer, I think, before we designate what Sierra 3 is. Big O ship, though. We're going to we're gonna find out what that ship is exactly. All right, let's get a little closer to the, uh, to the bottom here. Mm. All right, let's go on down. Go on down. Dive, dive, dive. All right, so we're going to try to uh, get a little lower here. Try to evade enemy torpedoes and such. They're going to have to drop them down way deep. Ooh, is that an enemy helicopter behind us? I guess not. You see that little, uh, what is that over there? Oh, what is it? Enemy heli is that an enemy helicopter? Low. Yes, enemy helicopter is looking for us. It's got its dipping sonar out, and it's listening for us. Luckily, we're escaping right now. Very good. You can hear that ship there crumbling. Nice. That's probably going to cover a lot of our sound, too. It's uh, very difficult for them to hear escaping uh, uh, an escaping uh, submarine with all the bubbles and possible screams of the Soviet Navy. But much respect to them, as they are our enemy, though. We've got to still show them respect. Because when you stop respecting the enemy, that's when they get you. All right, let's level off. Let's go ahead and see if we can get the Sierra 3 to come on over. Looks like she's on her way. I'm going to slow her down again. Let's see if Sierra 3, she's pinging us a little bit. Let's see what you are. Sounds like a big engine. Big old motor on this one. Let's see what it's got. Let's see. Come on, baby. What do you got for us? I'm seeing it. It, it could be this. It could be... What was that? Uh, not that, but... Uh, it's got to be one of these ships. Grisha, maybe. I'm not. It seems like there's a sonar blip at the end here, but it could be the could be the Pody FF. It could be the Grisha FFG. I would assume it's probably that, though it doesn't seem to match up fully. But I'm not seeing anything else that could be classified as that. So let's just call it a. Uh, we're going to call it the Grisha then. I could be way off. But we'll see. All right, so the Grisha 3 does have some weapons on it. Torpedoes, full-tail uh, HF Toad. Yet, so it's got definite weapons to look for us and listen for us. But all they're going to hear is the sound of their own impending doom. All right, we don't know what that is yet, so let's keep on trucking away. Luckily, that helicopter is way off in the distance. Navy SEALs are still on board, safe and sound. Let's go ahead and sneak over this way. We're going to go to the right side here, just to the uh, over to this little uh, peak. We're going to see if we can hide in the uh, shallower... Uh, water here, so if any torpedoes happen to come at us, we can uh, possibly lure them into the shallow water and explode. All right, Grisha 3 is getting a little closer. We want to be very, cl uh, very, very careful, very cautious when we get close here. We want to slow her on down. Now, obviously, we're supposed to hide from all these ships, but uh, I want to do it this way. It's a secondary objective, but really, I don't think there's any way you actually lose it. All right, they're coming right for us, so let's slow her down. Looks like Sierra 2 is coming over here as well. We'll see what that contact is soon enough. Grisha 3 is getting awfully close. Maybe we should fire a torpedo in her general direction. Let's go ahead and get ready to do that. Uh, immediately go into search mode and surface. Let's see if we can send right one right at the Grisha. And... Stop turning. Weapon is away. Okay. Second torpedo fired. Oh, God. No. Oh, I thought it'd be smarter than that. Don't go in the water. I mean the ground. Turn left. Uh-oh. Don't go into the ground. I think it's going to explode. Oh, there it goes. Oh my god. It's going right for its target? Oh it is. Wow, it didn't it didn't hit. Okay. Grisha 3 is hauling ass. She's finding her target. Oh, she's turning away. 
Oh, there she is. Is that a Grisha 3? What is that thing? What is that? Is that a Grisha 3? Oh, yeah, it looks... Uh, looks like it could be. Yep, looks like it might be a Grisha 3. I'm not sure. Could be the party, too. Welcome to the party. I think it's actually the party. It's the party FFs. Look at the back end. It's got giant foggers on it, too. Crazy. All right, here goes our torpedo. Back the other way, man. She's got a target. Chase that bastard down. All right, now we're good to go. We're just going to level off here and just stay a little bit to the left. Take a look at that torpedo. Oh man, it is so close. That ship is just hauling, baby. Look at those. Look at those engines, man. Those propellers just booming. And speaking of booming, oh, get wrecked. Get wrecked, son. Beautiful. Another Soviet ship down. And a beautiful distant explosion. Two torpedo hits. Thank God it didn't go into the dirt. I would have looked like a derp. Well, I am a derp, but don't get angry with me. I'm just having a good time. Just blowing up the Soviet Union. You know how it is. Everybody gets everybody gets their turn. All right, Sierra 2. Let's go ahead and identify what that target is. Signature, Sierra 2. Looks like it might be a potty as well. I think that might be another potty. Those things are fast, man. The potty or potty or pooty or poop poop put perp whatever. We're sending it to the bottom. All right. She's coming at us real quick too. We're gonna wait until we get a little bit closer to that one. Speed up time. If I could turn back time. Yes, we all know Cher. Cher was big with the Navy. You ever see that music video where she's singing on a battleship? Pretty sweet. Okay, let's swing around here. There we go. And let's get ready to fire. Okay, so we're going to have this weapon uh, engage and uh, basically go straight up into the air and chase. Hopefully we don't hit the dirt or anything. Wait. And weapon is away. Okay, there she goes. Oh, here she comes. Look up, boys. It's a Mark 48. All right, so Mark 48 is going to get to about this distance and then raise up and uh, hit that enemy ship. Looks like that ship's running. I should have waited a little bit. I got the Grisha, like, pinned up against the wall. But now the Poti is going to have to... Welcome to the Poti. She's turning now. They know what's there. Yep, go ahead and surface. Now, there should be another ship here somewhere. This looks. This feels a little too easy. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, that's the sinking ship. Don't go for that one. Oh, God, he's going for the sinking ship. No, not over there. Why isn't it? I can't uh, give it controls that I want to. Oh, that's going to be a wasted torpedo due to that. Wow, you couldn't... Oh, no. You couldn't see that other poti there? He might swing around once he misses this target. Oh, don't hit the wreck. Oh, he's going to. Oh, you fool. Oh, no. Well, there's another one for you, Pody. Damn. Well, we were on good course. I don't know what happened, but that torpedo kind of just went boop when it should have. It was just a hair away from reaching that other ship, and then it turned. But, man, eh, I can't win them all. All right. <clears throat> Doesn't matter. That was just a warning shot. Let's continue with our... Uh, Pody's going to come back here now. We're going to continue on course. He's coming back now. And he's not too happy with us either. I'm not too happy with that torpedo. Hopefully we don't encounter any other enemy ships. All right, let's stop here. We can uh, launch over our shoulder a bit. And...
Weapons away. Okay, let's see if he catches up with that ship. There we go. Oh, here she comes. Hopefully this makes up for my boo-boo. Oh, don't go that way. Go in a circle. Yeah, there we go. Reestablish contact. She's chasing again. Very good. Here comes the torpedo. Stay with it. Stay with it. Oh, she's uh, making some knuckles in the ground too, or in the in the ground in the water. There we go. Come on, baby. Ooh. Oh wow. Oh. No, it's coming back for us. You got to be kidding me. Torpedo's coming to us. You idiot. Damn, it's coming right for us. All right, stand by. We're going to drop a noisemaker here in a second. Damn you. This second ship has been very intelligent. All right, noisemaker's going out. A little too close. I've seen it uh, work at uh, short distances. You leave me alone. There we go. Wow, that's intense. Go back for the pody. Oh, you leave me alone. Come on. Go for the pody. See if we can hit him with another noisemaker. Woo, right up over the top. Being chased by my own torpedo now. Who would have thought? Yes, torpedoes do work both ways like this. Oh, now he's going for that. For the third time. <laughs> that guy is having a bad day. All right, we're just going to sneak past this other enemy ship then. Wow, for the third time in a row, that ship has been hit. You got to be kidding me. That crew is just having a horrific day. Oh, that Pody. I can't believe it, man. He did a great job of avoiding our torpedo speed and, uh, and change of uh, direction and course. I should say all good stuff. Thank God he's going over there. All right, we can just sneak in now. The Pody's going way, way away from us. So that's good. Oh, no, there's another contact over here, isn't there? Son of a... B uh oh, and they're, they're firing preemptive torpedo. Actually, there might be a sound detector on us. Damn, well, if that one we fired at the Gersha the second time had hit the Poti, we could have one extra torpedo, but now we're unarmed, so now we got to do it the good old-fashioned way. So now we're going to go in at top speed, which is 25 knots. That's as fast as we can uh, go with this weapon, or with this vessel. No weapons remaining. Pody's coming back. I don't think they know if we have anything left. There's nothing else we can reload. That's it. We just got the Navy SEALs on board. Passing 900 feet now. We can't go much more than this. That ship up there is extremely fast and very, 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 very effective at submarine hunting, too. Because they can fire all those torpedoes and such at us, or, or their guns, or they can just pursue depth charges, of course. A lot of these ships have as well. All right, let's go ahead and hug the sur uh, the uh, the floor. I want to say the surface. It is technically the surface. It is the surface of the earth. Welcome to it. All right, we're being active uh, active sonar ping now. And here comes those uh, depth charges. And I see another ship off in the distance. Here comes the depth charges now. Ooh. Planes are damaged here. Depth charges are coming in. Soviets are not happy with us. Damage control is at... Uh, hull is at 90%. We're okay here. We got some major flooding. We're going to go ahead and try to control that. All 
We got a long way to go, boys. That's why I wanted to destroy those ships. Oh, here comes the uh, here comes the uh, depth charges again. Knuckles formed. Oh boy! All right, here's where she gets intense. And not camping. All right, luckily those will mostly be under us. Enemy torpedoes pass by. Could be a good thing, actually. Could it hit the enemy uh, ships. All right, you see how my uh, tone has changed? Like now I'm all. Uh, before it was all jokes. Now it's all serious. Lots of enemy torpedoes out there. Uh-oh. Planes have been repaired. Torpedo tube is damaged, but we're okay because we're not firing any of those. Oh man, look at this. This submarine is just messed up, man. Huge gashes in this ship. Or this boat, I guess I should say. Pody's having its revenge for the two torpedoes we fired. Very good challenge. Your weapons are very limited. Torpedoes are kind of blocking the bay over here. I don't want to fight one of those. Or at least run from one. Fire control. Okay. Oh damn, is that torpedo? Oh, the torpedo's on the way. They fired a torpedo over this direction, it will pick up. Wonder if an enemy submarine is out there. Cavitating, but we need to avoid torpedoes. All right, we're pumping out specific uh, chambers that are flooded. Oh my goodness. Now's where it gets really exciting. Torpedo chase at slow speed. Multiple enemy ships destroyed. That's great to see off in the distance. Torpedoes reacquired. It's going to be a long time until we actually can uh, fire another depth, uh, uh, another uh, noisemaker. You stay away. Hey, how come you didn't? Hey, how you? Okay, you got. Okay, yeah, I, I know, I know. We're trying, we're trying it again. All right, one of those Sierras are now pursuing us here, and uh, we're gonna try to get a little bit closer to our enemy. We're getting a little too uh, low though in depth, so we're just gonna be uh, on the run a little bit. They're still firing depth charges at us. I got past two of those ships, destroyed them. You can see one over there, one off in the distance, and we got a uh, Sierra pursuing us right now. Whoever it is, they got depth charges, and hopefully we can fire over our shoulder, but. Unfortunately, they're a little, a little too much in hot pursuit. I think they're, uh, they got the hots for us, in terms of a lock on. All right, so we're very close to our position here. It's pretty much straight ahead, and uh, we've got uh, two torpedoes fired, two torpedoes hit on those ships. I'm still destined to launch that team, man. I want, I want to launch them. Where are these guys? Let's see stores. There they are. There are Navy SEALs are on board and ready to go. Just listening now for any sort of. Uh, Depth charge is being fired again. Okay, we're good. 800 feet. Level her off. Oh boy. Uh oh. Well, they're not happy with us. Could you imagine that? We've killed two of their friends. No wonder, Kami. Alright, let's go back up a little bit. 
I want to fire over the shoulder, but we're in hot pursuit right now with this ship. Let's go ahead and turn around on him. Let, let's just co go ahead and crazy Ivan him right now. Let's get ready to fire on him. A con radar, sonar contact, rather, is going to pick up here in a second. And there she is. Sierra 2 in hot pursuit. No, that's it right over there. Sierra 3 is what we're looking for. Here come those depth charges again. We're lowering down again. And they're around here somewhere. Oh, there they are. Cool guys, don't look at explosions. Yeah. Alright, I don't see any other ships around us. Aside from Sierra 3 off there. Wow, they're really firing those a long distance. Alright, I, I hate to... Uh, to engage him again, but we were on the run and he was getting pretty good at getting very close to us. So we're going to try to hit him as soon as he gets close enough. He's really far off. They know that we're deadly with our torpedoes, so it's all good. This is definitely one of the more challenging missions where it's basically like, hey, just sneak past. And it's like, oh, a stealth mission? Oh boy. All right. I don't see any more depth charges. Nothing spotted here. Sierra 3 off in the distance. We're getting closer to him now. Oh, depth charges again. Yep, he's firing. Alright, we're going to go low and to the right. 25 knots, maximum speed. Right to zero. A little easier running at him rather than away. All right, let's get ready to hit him. Torpedo ready. You better get running. All right, ahead one third. Bring down the speed. We got to be down to about 10 knots in order to fire this bad boy. Oh, boy. He's got active sonar on us. He's going to try to find us. All right, we're going to get to 10 knots and then shoot. All right, there he goes. No, go up. No, not there. Oh, my God. Go into the wreck again. How many torpedoes have I lose to wrecks, damn it? It's right up there. We probably should be closer to the surface, really. All right, we're going to turn around and face off again. Damn. Damn those torpedoes. It's, it's almost like Acme torpedoes all of a sudden. It's like Wildy Coyote. Damn it! Where's that enemy ship? Oh great. And now we're cavitating. Oh boy. Oh boy. Sierra 3, is he behind us? There he is. All right, contact reestablished. Here come the depth charges. Wow, they're just firing full time. We got to get away from this. He's going to reload quite quickly. Alright, weapons going towards him again. If we can just get this some bitch, we'll be good. Get him, boys. Alright, he's gonna circle around and find us, I think. Wire is broken. Oh man, it's intense. He's gonna circle around that ship. I should have put him in a circular uh, search pattern. If only I had that wire. All right, let's run. Damage control, a little damage on the hull there from the the old uh, depth charges. All 
Well, maybe our torpedo will find another ship. All right. We're going to continue on at full speed. Did he go into that ship again? No, he did. Did he go down there? Damn it. All right. Well, so much for that. I needed to put that thing on, like, circle. I shouldn't. I should have never came back. I was going to try to finish him off, but that was a bad move. All right. Well, now it's going to be an easy ride to our target. We're going to continue it uh, just down by about five. Let Sierra three chase us. We're out of uh, out of ammunition again. Two of those going right into the uh, wrecks. I guess uh, the, really what I should have done here is just been uh, higher in depth and then uh, got a little bit close to that other torpedo. I don't know why he deactivated so quickly. I don't know if he hit that wreck again or what. I love how they like going for those wrecks, though. Speaking of a wreck, I'm a total one right now. Oh, boy. So stressful, but fun. All right, we seem to have lost Sierra 3. Just adjusting our depth a little bit, make sure we're escaping. We're heading right towards the launch zone. So much for stealth. Enemy ship behind us. The hell was that? What is that? They're doing bombing or something? You see that? There was like lightning or something hitting the ocean floor. What the hell's he doing over there? All right, we're just trying to sneak sneak past here. No harm. I mean you no harm, just death. And destruction. Come on, baby, we can do this. No more torpedoes to stay away. What the hell's going on over there? Is he dropping depth charges or something? Weird. Uh-oh. That didn't sound good. Whoever... Is there torpedoes firing over there? What the hell is that? I can hear torpedoes. Hopefully a Kraken doesn't come out nowhere. Oh, boy. Torpedo. And she's coming right for us. Let's see if we can get away from this one. Oh, yeah. She's on search mode. Another torpedo. Oh. That was a mistake. I can see what seems to be our target over there. I'm not sure what that is. Well, that torpedo's totally looking for us. Stay with me, folks. We gotta do this one for America. Just speeding up time here as uh, I'm trying to crawl across the ocean floor. All right, there goes that torpedo. I hear another one firing off. I swear there's something on the ocean floor. At least we've lost our pursuers for the time being. Yeah, that looks like to be the edge of the naval base. I don't know if they're trying to fire torpedoes and just sucking or what. Oh god, I hear the helicopters. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Get ready. Here comes the torpedo. Did he... Oh, my God. He left us alone. No way. No way. Thank you, Ronald Reagan. You breast the... Breast. Ble oh, God. Now I said breast. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. 
I meant blessed. Damn you, God. All right, we're getting out of here. Knew there would be a torpedo. I just knew it. It's a fast one, too. He's going to lock onto us, no problem. Noisemaker away. Get cavitated. Yeah. Uh-oh. Damn it. Another uh, helicopter up there. Oh, boy. Couldn't you guys just leave me alone? Damn, Torpedo's going to come back. Alright, planes at 5, rudder at 5. Wow, that Torpedo... I'm holding my breath. Oh my god. Torpedo's going to swing around and find us. Yep, she's in a sur search pattern in our direction. She's got us. Alright, changing depth. There we go. Oh, wow, she's turning away completely. Beautiful. Go, baby. I watch that torpedo. We just need to put some distance between us and that. Oh boy, she's on us again. We can run her fuel out for sure. Oh my god. The intense action continues. I know. It's like, are we going to make it or not? There goes another noisemaker. See, we can swing to the right and get behind her. Damn it, she's on to us again. Nope, she's off us. Stay away from us, you commie bastard. Yeah, hell yeah, door's open. Oh my goodness, folks. Alright, we're going to circle back around. We're going to go to that beautiful blue circle. You raise me up so I can climb my mountain. Thank you, Lord. So proud. All right. Let's get down a little bit lower so we can get some speed. I don't know where we have to go or what we have to do, really. I've never launched these things before. Making that turn. Just a few dents. No problems. No flooding. Holes at 90. We good. It's all, it's all good. All right, passing 500 feet, we are good to go. As long as there's no more, no more Soviet uh, interference. All right, set planes to fight, and we're just going, we're going down a bit. I don't know where that helicopter went, but thank you, Jesus. All right, Navy SEALs are up next. Time for your guys' mission. Let's speed up time. And let's go into ultra stealth. Oh no. No, 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 no. Damn it, Sierra 4. Oh, and another contact off to this. Oh boy. <coughs> Feeling a little sick. Uh, someone else want to take over? <laughs> oh boy. All right. Uh, all ahead full then. Let's just get in there. Hell, I don't know what's up waiting off to the side. Probably a ship there. Just sitting on the side. What, what's going on? I don't know. All right. Well, we're just going to chug along here. Damn you. Should we be ultra quiet? I think we should just be fast. He seems to not be really going anywhere. 
I don't even think he's trying to like listen for us. All right, well let's just uh, maintain course here. Current course, depth, rudder, everything's the same. Watch for torpedoes. Sierra 4, watch it. What is that? Oh, dear God. Launch confirmed of a torpedo. Sierra 3. And that chopper's coming back, too. Get to the circle. Oh, you... Get running, baby. They're coming. Here comes that torpedo. Stay away, Sierra 4. Here comes that torpedo. Watch it. They're scary as hell when those things drop into the water. They're getting ready to set it for depth. And then bloop. might be too noisy down here but they're listening don't tell no secrets Soviets go here oh my god wow this uh, this is a difficult mission come on baby we can do this they left they're leaving us alone oh my god Ronald Reagan yes why I shouldn't say that because otherwise torpedoes also, I shouldn't say breast again, otherwise I'm going to get in trouble. Helicopter's gone? Oh my god. Okay, let's see what happens when we get to our area. Rig for ultra quiet. I don't know what Sierra 4 is off to the side. I guess, is that just a ship at anchor somewhere in the harbor? Or so? I, I don't... Is, there, is this even a harbor here? All right, we're in the circle here. Entrance Spec Ops deployment zone. Come to a stop to deploy. Okay. All stop. Okay, come to a stop to deploy. Okay, we're at one knot. <clears throat> we got to come to a stop. Is this... Uh, I'm at one knot. Is that good? How do I deploy these guys? I've never done this before. I don't know. Spec Ops cannot be deployed 100 feet. Oh, God. Okay, we got a surface. Son of a... All right. Break for ultra quiet. All right, we're good. Okay. We just need to surface. That's all. Oh, my God. Nobody, nobody make a sound. Nobody. Oh, great. And guess who's coming up the rear? Hello, Sierra 3. Nice to see you again. Hmm. Boy, is she coming in hot. No time. Haul ass. Those Navy SEALs will have to, uh, well, I'm sure they can avoid the ship. They're a lot harder to detect than the submarine. Damn, I can't believe I did this. So far, anyway. Alright, we want to make sure we don't start cavitating. Is 
600 feet. Oh, so intense. Stay away, CR3. Oh, God. Almost. Come on. Come on, baby. Oh, my God. We're almost there. Oh my god. Come on, baby. 100 feet is all I need. Come on, give it to me. Oh no. I thought I heard shot purse. Oh no. Okay, we gotta get real quiet. We're almost there. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay, alright, I got I got a drink. It's, it's better. I think it was seawater. Oh my god. Okay, let's just get out of here. Oh my god. No. Uh -oh. Don't cavitate. Don't do it. Don't you do it. Don't you do that. Alright, that's it for me, guys. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna haul tail out of here. We're gonna head over to like Wendy's or something like that. I think I I need like a a Dave's double. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's getting worse and worse for me. Oh, it's over. It's curtains for the uh, crazy dinosaur man. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Thanks for being here. I'm going to uh, get out of here then. I guess uh, we can pretty much leave combat, and that's mission complete. SEAL team is away. All right, thanks for tuning in, folks. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.